notice anything? I have three things to show you here. This first looks like a solid cube until I reveal the puzzle pieces. What's going on with this? If you wanna buy this or any sample I feature, I'll link to it at the end. But what I want to explain is this cutting process and all the cool things it makes possible. An electrical wire, the thickness of a human hair, traces the outline, cutting it through solid steel. Here's an actual clip of the cutting happening. But if a wire cut these out of a solid block, then shouldn't there be a gap the thickness of the wire? There's not, how come? Here's one that was just cut and you can see there is a big gap. So the cube wasn't cut into four. Instead, each piece was cut separately just so precisely that they fit perfectly. In fact, this gap is so narrow, it's actually airtight. These two cylinders are connected. So when you push the air down on one, it causes the other to lift up. So besides toys, this here is an example of where this process is used. This is a fuel injector from inside a car engine. It needs a very precise tip. But what else? Well, my favorite use of this technology is right there. See those slots that appear? What's that? Well, imagine you're putting together a nice wooden tabletop and you need a big screw there to hold the leg on. You don't want the ugly slots of a screw showing, so the slots are hidden thanks to wire EDM. And if you ever need to put the screw on and off, it magnetizes on, and there you go. Remove it. Pretty cool. You can make cool floating shelves with these screws, or a sleek wall mount. There's even a new mini screw with a tapered head, so you can recess it in thin materials like this. And everything I featured, you can buy if you want. I'll include links in the comments. Bookmark this or send it to a friend. Can you think of other applications of Wire EDM? Leave a comment and let me know.